Hello, what is going on guys? Sir Lewis here and I'm bringing you guys this video on the top three best apps to live stream from your phone. That's right guys, probably the first YouTuber making this video, all right? You're welcome. And, and you guys are going to be able to live stream not just your camera, but also your phone's screen, all right? So you guys can be playing a game and all that stuff and you could be live streaming on YouTube, all right? Twitch, Facebook, you name it, all right? And these three apps are for Android. And unfortunately, only one of them is on iPhone for iOS. And you guys already know me. I'm going to leave all the links in the description below. All right. You just click it. It'll take you to the Play Store or the Apple Store. And you guys can download it there. All right. And you guys also know about me is that I don't beat around the bush. Get out of here, bush. But um, I'm going to show you guys the features. All right. Get straight to the point and show you guys the features. And I'll even live stream. All right. And show you guys the buttons and everything. Um, while live streaming and before I show you guys the three apps and everything there's one important thing that you guys need to do that I'm gonna show you guys here how to do it and I even leave the link to be able to live stream on YouTube you need your YouTube account to be verified and don't worry you can do this by phone alright I'm just gonna show you it right here so you guys can see right here verify your account by phone you can get started with verification by going to YouTube slash verify and guys I'll leave a link to this right here in the description below if you guys are on your phone you guys just click it you'll be asked to provide a phone number for account verification so he can send you a verification code via voicemail or SMS and I actually did mine by SMS so so if you guys still need to verify your account just go in my description click on this right here all right it'll take you to this on your phone all right account verification step one out of two so then you just put your country all right and then you either put call me with an automated voice message or text me the verification code which I recommend so you click on that all right and then you just type in your phone number and press submit and then they'll send you a verification code and then you just type that in in your phone all right it's that easy it's that simple and then you'll be able to live stream on youtube all righty so starting with app number three which is camera fee as you guys can see right here just click on it i'm gonna leave the link for it in the description below so you guys just click on it and download it if you guys like it all right so as you guys can see you can live stream on youtube facebook ustream I don't even know that site right there, but you can live stream on there. But the one that we're going to focus on is YouTube, all right? And right here at the top, you guys just click the arrows right there. And you guys can either do screen capture or you guys can do camera capture, all right? And then it's very simple. You guys just click YouTube, Facebook, or whatever. And then you guys are going to log in to your account. And then after you guys log in, here at the bottom, you just press start, just like this. I'm going to press it right now. And then right here at the top, you guys can see this little circle right here where it says live. You just click on it, and then you guys are going to see the settings and everything. And don't worry, I'm going to show you guys real quick the settings and everything. So let's click on the settings right here. So right here, it already has me logged into my second YouTube account, Sir Lewis BR. It shows you right here, public. You guys can either do public, unlisted, or private live stream. All right, so maybe if you guys want to test your live stream, you guys can do unlisted so nobody can see it. Uh, you guys can also change the resolution which i recommend 720p for the best unless you have unless you don't have the best phone you guys can do 480 um you can put 720p right there you guys can either put low or medium and then to live stream you just press go all right right here and then right here which is awesome you guys can change the title of your live stream right here as you guys can see and you guys can also change from public to unlisted or private and then you guys can also change the resolution so then you guys just press create press start now and then it's gonna say broadcasting creating and then you guys can even check right here at the top camera feed live and you guys are definitely live streaming you can even click the, the icon right here and it says right here how long you've been live streaming so right here it's 30 seconds 31 seconds what's also cool is here in the eye it tells you how many viewers there are there's zero viewers because i i am live streaming unlisted so nobody's gonna be able to see this but you can do it publicly all right which is also cool you can press right here the chat so you can see what the people are saying in the chat which is awesome all right what else do they have here they have the camera so you guys can add your camera so you guys can see me right here hey what's up guys um move it around i don't think you could change the shape the size now you can't change the size but you can move it around this is a pretty good size anyway and you guys can also share your live stream which is awesome too so then you guys just press stop and then it'll end the live stream you just press ok and then there you go closing the broadcast and then what is awesome after is you guys can even share the live stream and it'll also tell you how much likes and dislikes that you got in that live stream the the time limit all right and the size of that live stream all right so my live stream was really quick so it was only 22 megabytes so yeah all right guys so that was camera feed now is the number two best live streaming app for your phone which is this one right here called ace screen stream all right that's what it's called 
so then you just click on it right here as you guys can see I'm already logged into my account you guys just click on the side right here and you guys could either log into twitch YouTube Facebook you just click on it log into your account all right and then you'll be ready to stream so then right here before you even stream you can enable the camera the face cam which you guys can put anywhere you guys can also enable the touches which you guys wherever you touch it'll show like the touches so if you want people to know where you're touching the phone on you can mute the microphone all right or you could either put their orientation to landscape or portrait all right so that's pretty awesome and then right here on the side before i start streaming i'm gonna show you guys here the settings which is very important the resolution it gives you 480 540 and 720 all right if you guys have the best phone put 720 it gives you the fps you guys can either put 24 or 30 i recommend 30 and then right here max bit rate it goes up from 8.4 all the way to 2 so i recommend 2 to get the best max bit rate all right so i'm gonna start live streaming so you guys can see how it works you just press right here in this big circle as you guys can see right here click on that and then after you guys click on your account you guys can change the title of your live stream so you guys can put whatever title you guys want right here and then you guys just press ok and it should say working working loading and you will start live streaming right now look at that four seconds five seconds it's telling you the amount of time that you've been live streaming all right so you guys can just go right here play your game all right have some fun and then to stop the live stream you guys just go right over here and then press stop and it's that easy all right and it'll be uploaded publicly unlisted whatever you guys want it to be all right so the number one app to live stream from your phone which you guys probably already know which is youtube gaming all right the reason why i have this app as number one is because it is out for android and iphones all right it doesn't have any watermark and it has definitely the best quality it doesn't lag or anything like that it's made from youtube so this is definitely the best one to live stream for youtube all right but if this app does not work on your phone, you guys can try the last two apps that I talked about. All the links are in the description below, all right? I'm gonna show you guys here the app. You just click on it right here, okay? It's gonna open up real quick. You guys can see that little heart right there. And you guys just basically log in with your account, okay? After you guys log in, you guys click this little icon right here at the top. You see with the arrow pointing at these two little lines right here. And then you guys will see right here, mobile capture, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Press next, all right? And then right here, you guys will see either record or stream. You could use this as a screen recorder also, which is awesome. But in this case, we're going to live stream to YouTube. So right here, you just press stream. It gives you either 720 or 480. You guys press 720 and then you guys press next. And then right here, they give you guys a few tips. All right. We don't feel like reading right now. So you just press next. All right. Then it takes you to your title. You guys can edit the title of your live stream straight from here. Then you guys just press next. Then they'll show you guys this where you guys can share your stream link all right to twitter facebook or whatever you guys just press next then you guys just press start now and then it'll take you guys automatically to the game that you guys are going to stream from all right so you guys can already see here the face cam and everything and don't worry it didn't start streaming yet you guys have to tap this icon right here as you guys can see tap to stream all right you have to tap that to start streaming but before we start streaming, I'm going to show you guys here how everything works so you guys can get it perfectly. So before you start streaming. So so right here, as you guys can see, this little icon right here, you press that. And this is right here, the size that you guys want your face cam to be. So if you guys want a really tiny, you can have it all the way there. If you guys want a medium, you guys can have it about right there. Or if you guys just want the full circle, you guys can have it there. But in this case, I'll have a medium right there. All right, this right here is like a filter. So if you guys want your face cams to be black and white, you could put BMW or you guys can put Cepeda. I don't even know. That's like a kind of like a, a weird filter. So then the next icon right here, as you guys can see, is this commenting icon. So basically this, you guys are going to be seeing the comments on the side, the bottom right hand corner. And after two seconds, they fade away. So if you guys don't want to see the comments, you guys don't want the comments to interfere as you guys play. You guys can click that to disable the comments so you guys don't see them. This right here is to mute your mic. So maybe your mom is screaming at you, all right, for not, you know, doing your laundry, not cleaning the dishes. So then if you guys want people to hear your mom screaming at you, you just click right there and I'll mute your mic and then people won't hear the mic. So then the last icon is the face cam icon to disable it or not. So maybe if you guys, you know, look weird like me, all right, you guys just click on that and and then it'll disable the the face cam and then it'll actually have your channel photo so you guys can see right here so once you guys got everything down all right you got the settings down your mom stops screaming at you all right you just click on that and then it'll start streaming as you guys can see right here it has the countdown and everything 
and then you guys just play and you guys can see that it's really really cool it's not laggy and then right here at the top bottom corner as you guys can see right here people are commenting that's how the comments will look like and then they fade away as you guys can see right there but if you guys don't want the comments you guys just press the icon like i told you guys and then once you guys want the live stream to end you just scroll right here at the top and then you press tap to end your live screen screen capture session so just tap that all right and then it should end you should get this message that says nice job you could check out your video on video manager at youtube just press okay got it and then you're basically done so yeah guys that's basically it those are the top three apps all links in the description below i hope to help you guys out all right and you guys already know me i like making my videos the best that they could possibly be all right so i take a lot of time editing my videos and everything so i want to thank everybody that likes my videos the comments and everything and if you guys are stuck or anything just comment below definitely comment back and help you guys out so yeah thank you guys so much for watching you guys are awesome i love all of you guys and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace